uh, you look kind of like a genius bringing Stefan in uh, Friday, and the next day he comes out and scores two goals. Um, you know, that surprised you at all that he comes in? And Doesn't surprise me. He's played the last two years in the NHL. I coach him in juniors. He's an offensive guy. Um, he's got great hands. Hockey sense is, is off the charts. So uh, I expect him to put big numbers up in, uh, in the American League. Uh, you obviously coached him earlier when he was in juniors uh, for a few years and everything. Um, you know, what do you like about sort of the, the personality side of things that he brings, you know, to a team like this? Well, he wants to win. You know, every every since we, uh, I've known him, he's wanted to win. He does whatever it takes to win, and that's what I like about him. You know, he has, like I said, the offensive IQ. He's got the, uh, great hands, um, smart with the puck, and uh, you know, he'll play a heavy game too. So. I like those things, but I like that he, he wants to win. He'll do whatever the coach asks him to, to win the game, and uh, he's just a good guy. Uh, if at all, obviously, you came in, you only had what, one practice in a morning skate to really <laughs> get accustomed to everything. Yeah, um, you know, the, the guys have been really good. Uh, I know I know a couple of them from playing with them in previous times, and uh, obviously, playing against a couple of those guys, too, uh, makes it easy to adapt. And, uh, you know, it's a, it's, it's a good group of them. So it is difficult coming in, but you know, with guys like this, it makes it really easy. Is it even a little, maybe a little easier, you know, that it's this early in the season that maybe you know guys haven't necessarily established, you know, line chemistry yet or anything? Or yeah, you know, well, kind of you know, line chemistry is kind of what you make it, right? It's not um, something that you just put on paper and all of a sudden you go out there and it's supposed to stick, you know. Um, uh, uh, but yeah, it's kind of, it's nice coming in with uh, with it being early in the year. Um, you were obviously at, at Dallas camp for a while, and then um, kind of how did this all come about that um, you know, that you ended up here last um, week? Yeah, well, so uh, Mike Vellucci was my coach uh, when I played Plymouth hey, 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 Juniors right. for four years, and uh, him and I still had a very good relationship. Um, you know, after he won last year, um, we had a you know pretty good communication, just just talking and you know, wishing him congratulations and all that. And, uh, Four-fold kind of came up, and uh, I sent him a message saying that I think we're, we're going to be looking for a job. Possibly, let me know if you guys have any access to veterans, and okay. um, I'd love to come in and be a part and play with you, play under you again. Um, and after that, you know, my the agency kind of took over and did whatever they had to do, and um, they had a couple other things that were somewhat in the works. But I felt overall this was the best fit for me. Um, you know, playing under somebody who believes so much in myself and in my game and can help me get back on the right path, especially after being injured last year for most of it. Um, it's, uh, it's, so far it's been really good. Is uh, Mike the same or any different at all? <laughs> Have you noticed since you last played for him? I'm not sure him, I or? should say that out loud. But, <laughs> <laughs> no, he's the exact same. He's exactly how I remember it. Um, it's, it's good to see a familiar face.